Hello everyone, I'm back today with another video. This is going to be the first video in a new series that I'm going to do. This is I'm going to call this the Road to 880, so basically the um, Road to Platinum Marshall. And so I figured, you know, I was Platinum Spy. I reached with this account uh, off of the Road to Platinum series. So why not try to go for Platinum Marshall, also in the same series? And I'm certainly not expecting to go undefeated in this series, uh, considering I've never actually made it to Platinum Marshall. I'm currently at an all-time uh, rating high of Platinum General, or 860 uh, uh, ELO on my um, other main account, Fairway. Uh, so that would be 20 off this goal that I'm trying to do here. But uh, we will do our best here to try to win as many as possible and see how many games it takes me um, to get to 700 right now, I'm at where I left off on the last game, and get to um, 880. So this should, uh, we'll see how this goes. Our first game here is with Pablo Ramirez. Um, he's kind of an infamous player. Uh, he's, he's got, a, I think he's got a decent amount of counts. I'll go ahead and hit this captain here. I'm not worried about losing that major. I'm sure a colonel's behind it, but that's fine. Or not, okay. So I'll go ahead and start uh, with this offensive here. We'll see. Alright, so, scouted that. Um, this might be like a lieutenant. Okay, sergeant, that's fine. So, he didn't have anything guarding this captain here. Um, I'm going to retreat, and I think I'm just going to retreat all the way back. I don't want to hit that and have him scout the spy, so I think that's a bluff, but I am still going to not take it. Um, so... Hmm, I'll take it. Oh, okay, it is an 8. Alright, that's fine. Not a big deal, because like I said, I got a captain out of it. So I'll go ahead and scout this. That might be a scout itself, yeah. And that'll be a trade-off scout there, and so I'm going to go ahead and elude that with the lieutenant and subtly cover up that spy there. Um, I'm going to go ahead and retreat back with this. I'm going to bring this captain out and see if I can threaten his colonel here. He's going to say that he's got back up there, so I'm going to back off with that captain. And we'll go ahead and see if we can get aggressive with this colonel here. See if we can get anything off of this here. This piece originated from there and he scouted this is probably a six right here so I'm gonna move up on that okay well that's too bad um, let's see I'm gonna move this uh, scout up here let's see what he does okay so let's just scout that and see what it is captain that's what I figured Okay, he's going to hit that uh, colonel there, so that's fine. I'll take a um, captain here. I'll also hit that scout. That's good. So let's see, it'd be great if we could um, trade captains. Perfect. So now I only have one known piece, and I can scout anything that he throws at my colonel here. So I'm going to go ahead and move this scout over, but for now I'm going to leave that colonel uh, where it is. See if we can do something in the center now. He doesn't know this captain, but he does know this captain, so. We would bring out this scout here. See if we can find anything. Um, it's probably a captain here. Okay, I figured. So we'll go ahead and bring up another captain just to fill in the spot there. So we're down a major, we know his colonel, he knows my colonel, I'm up. Captain and lieutenant, so it's a fairly even game, it's also pretty early, neither of us know marshal or general yet, I don't have any um, suspicions yet either, I assume probably either marshal or spy is over here. I think Ms. Marshall's probably going to be one of these two pieces here, I'm not sure which. But, I just have that feeling. But we'll see. Alright, um, 
I don't really know what to do here. Let me see if I can kind of bluff this general to me like a miner or something. I'm not really sure what to do. Interesting. Let's see, move in, see what he does. Ah, uh, so this is probably the marshal right here. But then, I would think about attacking this, but that's probably like a major and I'm just going to suicide my captain. So we'll just move the general down there and see what he does. Pretend that that's not a very good piece that I have here. I was going to maybe advance the general up here, but I'm not thinking that's such a good idea anymore. I'm trying to think about what to do here. Maybe I can Let's advance with the scout in the center. It's a worthless piece. Maybe just get some info here. Pretty sure this is the marshal right here. Alright, let's scout it. Lieutenant, okay. Not really sure what to do at this point. We're kind of in a sort of a stalemate position again. He doesn't know that captain there, but let's go ahead and bring up a major, see if we can kind of spearhead this. This very well might just be a scout, but oh well. Okay, let's see what we got here. Sergeant. That works. Alright, so we'll go ahead and retreat with this here. Okay, I'm going to move this captain over. I'm going to leave that there and see if I can bring this lieutenant up. Another. Okay, sure. I don't have a problem with that. I went from being down a sergeant to now being up a sergeant. And I can't complain about that. Alright, so now the... Colonel is making an escape here. Okay, now the colonel's coming around to the other side. And piece that I suspect might be the marshal. I know this player does sometimes like to have a sudden aggressive um, tendencies, like he'll just randomly be very aggressive. Interesting that he'll just walk his colonel into there like that, but, you know, I suppose it's probably just a scout, and he figures he could have scouted that if that was a good piece. So, not much happening again here. I do want to keep that spy out just in case for the marshal here. Oh, well, what I think is the marshal, I'm not really sure. Let's go ahead and scout. This is probably a scout. Yep. Okay, so we're up three pieces and he's up one. Let's go ahead and get this major into play and see what we can do because he brought that colonel all the way from the other side of the board to trade. Let's see. I'll just leave that there, I think. Hmm. Let's bring this sergeant up and see what we can do. I'm going to trade this off here. Move in with this sergeant. Okay, so he's going to waste a scout on that, which is great for me. Let's see, I'll go ahead and threaten this. This is probably a captain, maybe even a major here, but who knows. Okay, here's the suspected marshal coming into action here. We want to be ready for that. Alright, let's just attack this and see what it is. Major. So we'll make him think that we're unsuspecting. Um, okay. Let's see what he does if I do this. Interesting. So it's probably a pretty risky move in general, but I'm trying to figure out what he's doing.
Hmm. This is really odd situation. I'm pretty sure this is the marshal right here, honestly. I mean, but he's he was really acting like it, and I just have some sort of tendency to believe that here, but this is pretty interesting, in fact. Let's see if I do that, what he does here. You know what? I'm going to hit it. Whatever. Wow. What a guess. That is amazing. I cannot believe I did that. That's just absolutely... That's unheard of. The fact that he just let me cycle through all those pieces, and I guessed from a few minutes into the game that was his marshal. And him just letting me approach any piece with that, I mean, that kind of dampened my suspicions, but I decided to go with my gut, and that's pretty crazy, but he just surrendered off the bat as a result, but that's a pretty crazy game there. But that goes to show you how intuition can really, um, can really elevate your game so that you can, like, guess what the piece is before you actually know and you don't even have to use pieces on it. Like, that piece there covering the kernel, I mean, of course you think it's the marshal, uh, right? I mean, he was, like, almost begging me to hit it with what he suspected was my general. Uh, in what I bluffed with the captain, but that is a really crazy win um, overall. I, I mean, really the climax of that is taking the marshal, of course, and he surrendered afterward, but I still can't believe I did that. But good game, um, Pablo Ramirez. And that's going to put me almost at Platinum Scout, but so far we're starting out good, so we'll see how the rest of the series goes.